identify the prosthesis on the basis of preparation shown in the image so we have three images here of a maxillary central incisor it is always good to consolidate all the data in our minds so that we know that all the information is in one place the margin is uniform throughout from the first image okay uniform thickness secondly your is a flat end burr in the second third second image it is a full coverage restoration for sure because the entire tooth is prepared then there is a hatchet here that's smoothening the floor of the finish line okay and the incisal reduction is quite obvious as compared to the adjacent tooth so clearance is more okay what else can we see i think that's all all right so now all ceramic crown is an option pfm crown is an option wrap around porcelain veneer and virginia bridge let's talk about each of them in a little gist all ceramic crown then there was pfm crown there is wrap around veneer and there is virginia bridge all ceramic shoulder margin full coverage okay pfm labially shoulder Palatally chamfer. Again, this is full coverage. Shoulder means right, ninety degree. I hope this is clear. This is ninety degree shoulder, and obtuse is chamfer greater than hundred and ten degrees. Okay, wrap around veneer covers the labial surface, and only the incisal third of the palatal surface. okay so if say this is your central incisor then the labial surface and only some part of the palatal surface so it's a partial coverage crown and virginia bridge is a resin bonded restoration with wings from the family of maryland rochet so the preparation for that is also different this is also partial coverage retainer so naturally these two options which are partial coverage are eliminated right that leaves us with pfm pfm and all ceramic now both can be given in an anterior tooth but the differentiating factor would be the uniformity of the margin so this is one uniform margin over here which is indicative of all ceramic restoration so this is how uh, the all ceramic restoration preparation is shoulder uniformly everywhere which provides the marginal integrity and structural durability and an axial reduction that is going to be biplanar like this rounded off uh, angles or line angles and point angles have to be rounded of the cingulum preparation uh, reduction is also supposed to be like this as shown in the image the same way we can see that here okay so this preparation is suggestive of an all ceramic crown that is option number 1